Ah, uh, welcome back viewers. Thank you everyone for joining. Uh, at the completion of my um, XCOM Long War series, a number of people asked that I would uh, carry on with another uh, alien uh, fighting game, either uh, Xenonauts 2 or uh, play uh, XCOM 2, specifically XCOM 2, War of the Chosen, Long War of the Chosen. Um, now, uh, full disclosure here, I've not played uh, Xenonauts 2. I uh, haven't, uh, haven't had a chance to play it yet. I have played uh, XCOM 2. I have played XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. Uh, but I don't think I completed War of the Chosen. I completed XCOM 2, but I did not complete XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. And I've never played Long War of the Chosen. So we're going to try this, see what happens. Uh, Let's, uh, let's get right into it. Uh, I know there's a ton of uh, information out there on it, but eh, we'll see. I mean, you know, I may end up, uh, I may end up uh, getting my hat handed to me, but we'll, uh, we'll play it as is. I'll, I'm, uh, let's see, difficult. Not, not Legend, not Command. It's the first time I played long more on this, uh, on this game. Uh, no, I don't think I need to be a. Oh, we'll do veteran. We'll just try veteran. No, Iron Man. I will uh, reserve the right to restart. Uh, integrate. I've, done, I've downloaded all the Long War uh, of the Chosen bit. Accessing the feed now. Uh, we're gonna. Uh, we're in. I'm gonna skip this uh, video and skip this video. I mean, they're wonderful things, but uh, the 411 on it is um, Earth lost the war in the first one, the first XCOM. They lost it. Uh, the aliens have taken over the planet. They've been here for 20 years. The uh, original commander was captured by... Uh, uh, the original XCOM commander was captured and uh, was being used to do nefarious things, uh, uh, leveraging his knowledge and his expertise as they mind-controlled him uh, to fight resistances. Uh, we are a guerrilla organization that has been able to um, uh, free the ex-commander. Uh, and he has uh, now been uh, freed and is uh, running XCOM, XCOM 2. And uh, we're going to go on our first mission, which is called uh, Operation Gate Crasher. And this is... Um, the tunnel's under Bangalore, Indi India. So we're in India. So let's press this and, uh, and go. All right, welcome to the first mission of Long War of the Chosen. Object is simple, kill all the enemies. Note that this is one of the few missions that allow for a retrieval of enemy corpses. That's new, which are needed for research and building many items. Kills with explosives destroy corpses in Long War of the Chosen. So... We don't want to blow up enemies as much as we want to maybe use grenades to, um, let's say, use grenades to injure them and finish them up with gunfire. Let's take a look at our troops. Uh, Sean Wade, we've got grenade and uh, flashbang. Assemblar warriors, my followers specialize in wielding psionic energy, mastering the power that belongs to all who are truly of this earth. Through intense focus, we can twist the very fabric of the world around us to suit our needs. Okay, so we have a specialized troop. Templars gain focus during missions by using rend regardless of whether they hit or not. Focus can be spent on powerful abilities, some of which have increased effectiveness when used at higher focus levels. So, this is Mystic. Luke Andre, let's confirm that. And he's got a rend ability, a volt ability, one for all, which is, which is, I'm assuming, yes, uh, just provide high cover. So he's like, a, you know, it could be a tank. And a flashbang grenade, what's this bolt? Non-turn ending AOE attack that makes targets easier hit. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, how much focus? Do it doesn't look like he has any focus at the moment. I've got to do an attack to get a focus, it looks like. Um, Frida has a grenade flashbang. 
Flynn has grenade flashbang. Clara, grenade flashbang. Uh, Mario, uh, Flynn, grenade flashbang. And Bill, grenade flashbang. And we're back to the beginning. So, I don't like this because I saw, let's see. Let's sure what's going on here. I don't want to kick down a door or anything. I don't see any way to I don't see any way to get up high. And I don't see any enemies. So let's just sort of take our time here. Rita, I'm gonna put you over here. Moving the designated coordinates. Because this is is this the end of the map here? This is the end of the map here. Let's go forward. Doesn't look like it. I just want to find out if I'm in a corner. Oh, this goes down over here. So this is kind of a... Let's see how far over this goes. See, is, that, is that the end of it there? I can't really tell. I'm going to assume... Maybe it goes around the corner there, so we'll see. All right. Confirmed on the move. Peek around the corner. The athletic ah. officers seem more capable than the grunts. We're not sure whether to chalk it up to training or stricter mind control. Okay, this is uh, this is going to be our first target. See if we can uh, isolate these guys and get uh, get attacks on them. Problem is, I don't really have a good way to to get close to them. I can't really climb up here. I can't get up on top of this building up here. It looks like. So we're kind of in a uh, kind of in a, uh, a bad position here because I don't have much room to maneuver. Good copy. Moving on target. Let's see. We may just have to try to rush them. Position. That's affirmative. Okay, we've got a couple of people that get visibility on them. Run people all the way over to here, which might be okay. Let's try this. Double time. Really a bad thing. I'm gonna leave you uh, not on Overwatch, even though you see all four. Yeah, I think I will have you go to Overwatch. Leaving to Overwatch. Yeah, we'll give you Overwatch just in case. Overwatch. Behind. I don't know. I guess I'll do that. Understood. Roger. I've got my eyes on. Yeah, they're walking away. 
Doesn't help me much. Go ahead and pursue down this way. Again, I don't want them all ending up in uh, one big group somewhere where I have to fight multiple uh, multiple groups at one time. That would be that would be bad. Safe. I don't think anyone can see me coming in this way. Moving. Don't see him. They'll probably circle back around, which means I just got to be patient. On my way. Ah. Where did you spot him? That's them there, okay. Not the best place for you, but let's see if we can get people into position to uh, to cause some grief here. Location confirmed. Let's do this. Confirmed. Got my eyes on. 
Flashbang and go from there. Here we go. This one's gonna be bright. Let it go. They're on to us. Okay. These guys make up the bulk of the advent forces we've dealt with. They're disciplined and well equipped, but their obedience makes them predictable. Oh, their drone's gonna move first, I bet, and I'm gonna soak up all of my firepower on the drone. That sucks. That didn't do as well as I was hoping. Drone there, troopers here. Okay, so who gets to shoot? Robert, you gotta move. You're not in really a good place to move. Whisper, you can move. Just these four. Mystic, you can't you can't even get close to something. Come here and hit the Let's try this. Come here. And hundred percent on him. Ninety-two percent, four to six. See if we take his out. This world is ours. Well, I like that. The strength of the Templars ebbs and flows with the tide of combat. As we focus our energy, our power increases and can be oh. unleashed upon our enemies. So they get another move. So I can move him. Then go into one for all or whatever. All right, so let's let's hold on that. Lambert. That's probably the best place for you. I can hit these guys with another flashbang, or I can use a grenade. Grenade's gonna kill them though. I don't want to kill them. Grenades. Oh, come on up. Okay, I'll go. 49, 46, 37. Those are really bad, bad. I can 
hunk her down there. Might make it hard for them to hit her. Moving to position. Not the best. I'm going to go into Overwatch with you. I'm on it. I really don't have a good place to move. To. I can move you to here. The problem is I'm worried about them throwing grenades on me. But no problem, boss. Really bad shots there. See, I think this guy's going to move gonna force him to move. So we should get shots on him. Although the Overwatch mechanic is a little different now because they can take one step and not trigger an Overwatch from what I understand. So let's um or I can throw a grenade. Take down that and lose his cover. Now let's let's think about this Let's take out his cover. Throw a grenade! If it kills him, it kills him. Wow, it killed him. And loot lost, of course. Yikes. Overwatch. So you throw your flashbang in here. You watching? That'll end his Overwatch. Overwatch removed. Now I gotta be careful out here. Let's see who do I have to move? Risk it for the biscuit. We'll come into a uh, rent here. Hundred percent. Wow. My strike successful. And we get an advanced scope. And he's got multiple focus and momentum. So let's. Um, that group is down. Nobody's hurt. Let's, uh, let's come back over here and grab this loot. And a data pad. All right. All right. Uh, let's get folks reloaded and in position here. Finally. Yeah, give me a reload. Good to go. and security on these doors. Come here. On the move. All right, so you go 
give me an overwatch. Affirmative, covering now. You give me an overwatch. Overwatch. You give me an overwatch. On overwatch. All right, we got more aliens coming. Although they bear some resemblance to the sectoids first encountered during the invasion, their genetic structure now includes human DNA. They are stronger than ever, with an even greater psionic oh, potential. Good hit. Good hits. All right. So that was not bad at all. Probably another alien back there. I don't. I th wouldn't expect just one sectoid and one. So come here. Here I come. It's both up with that. You watching? Enemies, Advent Infantry. Sentries are blue, gunners are green. 
specialized in Overwatch, sport a high damage cannon. Grenadiers, great, they're red. And Rocketeers are orange. Oh my god, what have I got here? What am I running into? What, what have I got? I got... Blue. This guy's green. So he's got a he's got a cannon. Alright. So this is gonna be okay. Hang on here. I may want to run back. And I think I do. I think I want to run back to some place a little more, a little safer. Or I could go up. Uh, that's interesting. Hang on here. Can they climb up? Doesn't look like they can climb up here. Well, this is interesting. So do I do I risk doing something like this? I'm gonna do it. I have no idea if this is a good move, and maybe a bad move. Now notice here I've got two people. I saw two people behind this door. They're probably gonna come through this door. So we're gonna just wait here you guys. I can handle that. And we're going to pop that door on and surprise them. So we're just going to do an overwatch. Got it covered. Do an overwatch. So your I'm job is to handle these guys as they come through. So see, they're going to come through. Oh! I didn't like that. Oh, well, that's a mess. That is not good. Get him! Uh, I don't like this guy's got a cannon. I don't like that. That's a big cannon. Who do you shoot at? I don't I don't I don't Okay, suppression. Alright, okay, okay. That didn't feel good. Close. All right. Ready for anything. All right, so I'm here. at 100%. That won't stop it. Can't attack him again, though. Try a 44 on him. I don't like him. He's got a big gun. Good job. I got it! Right? He did good. You did good! Need a resupply! Yeah, I know, I know. We're gonna worry about resupplying here in a minute. You've got a flashbang. Need to flashbang this group here. If all possible. Flashbang up there. Yes, we can. That's a grenade. That's a grenadier there. 
That's not good. Need a light? where we're going to give him a little bit of surprise. Sean, open a door. No, not that door. Sean, open the other door. It doesn't count cost of that door. So you see him at 83%. Put some hurt on him. How many is that now? Well, there's another one back here, I thought. A real good place to go. Maybe come up here. I'm going. I thought there was another guy in there. I could be wrong, but I'm going to throw a flashbang up here anyway. Light him up! Just in case. Okay, that was probably kind of useless. I have momentum. What can I do with a momentum? Three guys left. I think you need to uh, come back a little bit. We got him killed. Here. Let's see, one of these guys come out and get right next to you. That's not good. Okay. Give me an overwatch. Moving to overwatch. I'd be surprised if I kill him, but he's a, a grenadier. I don't want to do... Th throw it. Throwing grenades! Okay, that's good. And give me... Give me an overwatch. On overwatch! back up here. I think that's the safest place to be. Too disoriented. Okay. I'm head down here. Oh! They're really doing a job on him. Get him! I'll ah. get him next time. Not even close. Flash him again. Light him up! Did that not... Oh, they may have already been disoriented. Or did I completely... Did I completely misplay that? That may have been a misplay. I didn't get through the wall. Okay. Oh, my bad. Next 
time. My ammo's running low. I'm on it. I'm just the target. really having trouble hitting these guys. Ammo out! I guess that'll be okay. Catch! Don't want to do this, but... I know I'm losing bodies here. Confirmation. Area secured. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. Now oh, it's one wounded. We must never allow these dissidents to fill our hearts with fear. Their victory today. There's no way the aliens were expecting a fight like that. I'm impressed, Commander. I like Johnson. Sectoid corpse, that's good. Trooper, officer, drone racks, supplies, Illyrium crystals, and alloys. Okay, let's continue this. Recover one of the art advent data pads from the field, where it's valuable intel stored with it. We can recover the intel, but it'll require some time. Okay. Continue. And long war of the of the chosen is a complete overhaul to XCOM 2 War War of the of the Chosen that makes the campaign more challenging feel like a guerrilla war. You can disable this tutorial via... All right, I'm not gonna... I'm gonna keep the tutorial. All right, so... Manage your havens. Let's see. Your old man would be proud of what we've managed to and do here. Discover a lead in progress. What uh, you've managed to do with this ship. I just wish he had lived long enough to see us fight back. To know that it wasn't all for nothing. Trust me, he knows. If there was one thing your father always kept in mind, it was his faith in humanity. He knew we could win. Or not. So... Impressive, isn't it? Capable of generating immense power. Yet completely harmless to human life. If only the same could be said for the rest of the alien's technology. Commander. Dr. Richard Tigan, Chief Science Officer. I am responsible for the entirety of our research here. As well as the procedure you so recently underwent. Welcome to my lab, such as it is. I'm not sure what Central may have told you, but we found something while removing you from the alien stasis suit. A device implanted directly in your occipital lobe. Had I access to the equipment available to me during my tenure at Advent, I would already know the precise nature of its function. However, given time and your approval, of course, Commander, I assure you, I will find out. 
Which brings to light an additional point. Though aspects of this facility are indeed impressive, I am but one man. Were you to direct additional support personnel and resources to me, I could substantially improve the speed of all our research. A farewell, Commander. So one of the tenets here is we need to get more scientists. Right now we have no scientists. And part of the game is you need to collect scientists and engineers, just like in the original XCOM. So we do have new research. Let's see what the new research is. We can do resistance communication, uh, modular weapons, alien biotech, experimental weapons, research the encrypted data pad, basic research, and engineering research. So I'm going to hold on this for a second. I think the, the recommendation is to do this resistance communication so we can find additional resistance groups that were um, that are out there and then start linking them together that's one way that we gain additional um, additional information so we're going to just hold on that but i think that's what i want to go go to i want to do the uh, resistance communication first although i'm i'm very much intrigued with uh, modular weapons and experimental weapons but again these take a little bit more time well, no, the modular weapons only take four days. But we'll see what we can do here, okay? And as we get more researchers or more scientists, we'll be able to uh, develop our research a little bit quicker. So let's go to engineering. Uh, yeah, leave anyway. I'll, I'll get back to it. Don't worry. And this is... Uh, okay. Reworked your repulsors with some of the parts I salvaged from their old engine. Should fix that stabilization problem you had. Come on, Rover. It'll work. Commander! Getting our tech to talk to theirs is harder than you'd think. Lily Shen, Chief Engineer, at your service. I like the hammer and pipe bridge. You were probably expecting to see my father. In all that's happened, I'm guessing Central didn't tell you yet. He's gone. Dad gave everything he had to get us this far. This entire ship is his life's work. I know he would have loved to show you around the place himself. He used to talk about you a lot. You can be sure I'm ready to finish what he started. Might not look it, but in here, I can fabricate pretty much anything you come up with. And with a little more help, well, you'd be amazed with what I can do. It was an honor to finally meet you, Commander. Okay. So, in case you haven't figured it out. Commander, to the armory. Uh, I'll, I'll get there, Commander. Um, again, we have no engineers at this point. Um, we've got a few things in our inventory again. Uh, items we need for research. Items. You'd be surprised how big of a difference some of these things can make in combat, Commander. Shape charges. With a few supplies, you know, the only thing I can I manufacture can anything we need in no time. But, but we can also, and this is uh, probably key to this. There's room for us to expand our facilities on board the Avenger, is, Commander. Instead of a but base. But we'll need more engineers to clear out space for construction first. This is our ship. These are all the areas. So we've we've reckoned, uh, we've been able to uh, to. Uh, steal or obtain an alien spaceship and then we've got uh, one room that I can build a facility in and everything else is going to require engineers as you go over each one of them it'll say engineers uh, if we clear the debris here we'll get 41 supplies uh, if I clear it here I'll get 45 supplies and 10 alloys and as you go deeper down you get more supplies more research more resources, more uh, more supplies, more alien uh, allies. The trick is, what do you want to build first? So there's a resistance ring, there's a training center, lab, workshop, power relays, infirmary, and a guerrilla tactics school. You can see they take different amounts of power and different amounts of supplies. Currently I've got 200 supplies and uh, I've got 5 of 12 power. So if I wanted to build a training center, it would take 150 supplies and 3 power. Or for guerrilla tactics school, 152 power. 
150 and 3 power, 120 and 4 power, 101 power, 153 power, and the resistance ring is 80 with only 3 power. So again, we're going to just hold on what we're going to build here until uh, till we walk through this a little bit, uh, a little bit further. Um, let's go to the armory real quick. I probably could have saved a lot of time repairing the ship's systems if we had any idea how to translate their language. Unfortunately, we don't come across many linguists out here. Incoming transmission. All right, we'll, we'll get to the command center. So you get these, like... Uh, photo cards that they do for each fight, things like that. Um, and then we can look at our, our soldiers here. And as you can see, here we are. We've got all our troops. Uh, Flynn took some hits, but you can see we've got Templars. This is our Templar. Then all of these different uh, rookies. And I don't think I can... Um, let's go toggle details. There we go. Uh, so you've got... Um, Let's just look at one of them. We'll look at, uh, at Bill here. So Bill has got a, uh, four health, mobility, dodge capability, hacking capability, aim, his will, and his available status, and how many missions he's been in. Combat intelligence is low. He's unbound. We don't have any AP points because you, you need to build a training center to get AP points, which gives you different, uh, different items. So I'm not going to promote him yet or anything like that. Um, We'll just walk through all these. I'll walk through all these and, and come up with with what I really want to do with them. And we can come down here and look. You'll, you'll see that you know we've got 60. Oh, this one's this one's got a 57 aim, uh, but high health. So you know you, you get the idea of the way it was in 56. Holy mackerel, that's really bad. Do I have anybody with it? There's a 74. That's pretty good. Any of our any of our uh, yeah like. Uh, like Bill here has got a 75 aim, so he's probably going to be a good one for a, for a sniper. Or, or, again, I don't know all the classes in Long War, so we'll see. But I'm just looking down through, and we've got some mostly in the 60s. We've got a few 70s, and we've got a couple uh, a couple 50s. Uh, so we'll we'll see how all that plays out. Commander to the research labs. I'm not going to go to the research labs. I'm going to go to the command center. <laughs> Hello, Commander. The council you once knew is no more. Its membership have all sworn loyalty to the Advent Administration. With one exception. It is good to see you again. In the days since your capture, I have done all I can to aid the Resistance from the inside. It was these Resistance operatives that provided the intel leading to your recent extraction. As of now, Resistance forces are currently somewhat disorganized. If we are to defeat Advent and their alien masters, you must change this before it is too late. Ah, uh, there you go. Uh, Long War of the Sozin help. Long War of the Chosen has several entries to the XCOM archive that will explain some of the core concepts in more detail, like infiltration and haven management. You also review all your havens from one screen via the resistance manager menu. All right, so I think um, we are in Indonesia, it looks like. So let's let's go back here and we'll show the uh, let's show the world map. And I think that's well, yeah, we'll do the show the world map. Commander, good to see you on your feet again. Oops. No, 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 no. Ignore that. This new Templar operative may be a bit unique, but so far everything seems on the level. We're receiving the position of the Templar HQ now. We don't know much about these Templars, so it might be worth sticking around here for a while, as well as contacting Geist, their leader. My people understand the value of our cooperation, Commander. The Elders see us as nothing more than raw materials for their designs. We will take back our power and turn it against them. So we've got... I greet you as an ally facing a shared enemy. My followers seek balance with the psionic forces that flow through the Earth and all its inhabitants. We channel this energy 
aided by technology of our own design to pursue justice for those who have fallen victim to the elders and their servants. Okay, so resistance faction located, the Surveyors of the Stars. These are our Templars, that's the guy that we had. New faction orders granted, bonds of war, feedback, and a covert action now available in the ring. Gain ability points, so let's just continue here. And review your haven. Uh, we'll take a look at this. This is so. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. So the black market's down here. We have a haven in uh, Indonesia. So we're running around in Indonesia, south, I guess in in, in Templar Hel uh, headquarters is here. Our ship is right next to it. We don't see any other zones at this point. But you can see there is a world map, and there will be different zones that we will be able to go to as we as we manage this forward. So our options here are uh, one day to go to the black market if we're searching there. Uh, we can go to the Templar headquarters, which will allow us to heal faster, or we can go for uh, Advent and start looking for uh, or go to our our uh, Haven. Uh, resistance center and to get intel so I think that's where I'm going to uh, and I got to set these resistance priorities I gotta I gotta figure out where, where all that works so again thank you very much for watching got a few things to do here uh, but we'll uh, end it here and we'll pick this up next time so thank you very much for watching commander the lab is currently yeah idle. yeah I know just give me a break um, and everyone have a terrific day